People get hurt at work every day in Georgia, and oftentimes these injuries are debilitating. The workers start losing paychecks, they need continuing medical treatment, and they worry if they will ever be able to return to their jobs. Well, under Georgia law, there are three different types of benefits an injured worker can receive. These are wage benefits, medical benefits, and permanent partial disability benefits. In this segment, I'll explain the second of these benefits, medical benefits. Now, if you're hurt on the job in Georgia and your employer has three or more employees, they are obligated to have workers' compensation coverage for you. And this coverage will allow you to have your medical treatment covered for your on-the-job injuries with an authorized treating physician. And, well, how do you determine who will be your authorized treating physician? Let me show you something that will help explain this. By law, your employer has to post a pink panel of physicians from which you can select a doctor to treat you. The panel has to have at least six physicians listed on it. It must have at least one orthopedic surgeon, one minority physician, and no more than two industrial clinics. If the employer did not post a panel of physicians or the panel the employer posted was not valid under Georgia law, you may be free to select the physician of your choice to treat you. The very first thing we do at my office is to ask for a copy of the panel of physicians that was supposedly posted on the date of my client's accident. Under workers' compensation here in Georgia, the authorized treating physician really controls what happens in your claim. So you want to have a doctor that you can trust that'll be providing treatment to you. Now let me tell you about another option you have. If the employer had a valid panel of physicians posted, but you did not like the doctor that's treating you, you are entitled to a one-time change to another doctor on that panel of physicians. Most of the time, the insurance company will not tell you about this option. And here's one final option for you. It's called an independent medical exam, or IME. If you've been injured on the job and have received workers' compensation wage checks, you may be entitled to a one-time examination with a doctor of your choice, and the insurance company has to pay for it. You may have a chance to have your doctor conduct an examination to give you his or her unbiased opinion, not only about your injuries, but also provide you feedback about what tests may need to be ordered or what treatment options are available to you. When we have this report for our clients, we can even pursue a possible change of physicians to this doctor. So if you or a family member has suffered a work-related injury, I highly recommend you speak with us as soon as possible to learn your rights and the insurance company's responsibilities under the workers' compensation laws here in Georgia. You have absolutely nothing to lose by calling a lawyer, but think of all you can lose if you don't.